The new world has a profound thirst for higher computation power, which translates to faster communications, more sophisticated AIs, real-time better forecasting models, and so on. However, conventional electronics get too hot if you make them calculate too fast. The core of any conventional computation device consists of billions of transistors that are functioning as electrical switches. Through my research, I am trying to exploit light interactions in a fiber to develop a light-based optical switch, which is one million times faster than its electronic counterparts without even getting hot. The essential part of my research is a marvelous wave called soliton. For the first time in 1834, John Scott Russell observed that a solitary wave maintains its shape while it propagates in the Union Canal in Escotlan. This waveform is interesting on its own, as you can see in the face of these visitors. However, it also finds an important application in designing optical switches. Around 40 years ago, scientists could justify the existence of such soliton waves in fiber optics as well. I study the interactions between two different kinds of solitons co-propagating in a fiber at the same time. In certain conditions, one of them will be trapped into the other, just like a ball that is trapped into a hole, or will escape otherwise. Based on these two different situations, an optical switch may be applicable to be designed, and this may lead to a much faster computational device that doesn't heat up as it functions. <laughs>